Sergio Ramos helped Sevilla get a point against his former club Real Madrid. Real Madrid tied with Sevilla on Saturday, but Carlo Ancelotti's side will face Barcelona next weekend at the top of La Liga. Real Madrid warmed up for their first Clásico of the season with a 1-1 draw with Ramon Sanchez Pizjuan as Los Blancos were on course for their second loss of the season when David Alaba scored into their own net. Carvajal headed home a Tony Cruz free kick to make it 1-1 before former Real Madrid captain Sergio Ramos missed a golden opportunity in stoppage time to give new Sevilla coach Diego Alonso victory in his first match in charge. The 1-1 draw lifted Real Madrid to 25 points as second and third place Girona and Barcelona play their matches on Sunday against Almeria and Athletic Bilbao, but neither of them can move to the top ahead of Saturday's match at the Olympic Stadium in Catalonia. Real Madrid players were dissatisfied with the decisions to cancel two goals by Fede Valverde and Jude Bellingham, after Sevilla player Lucas Ocampos was injured while Real Madrid was advancing. The referee performed well, Ancelotti said in a press conference, perhaps with a hint of sarcasm. He played a good match. He stopped the counterattack to take care of the player's health. I think he played a high-level match. The coach later explained that only by speaking this way could he avoid being suspended for revealing his true feelings. Ancelotti told Real Madrid TV. Irony is the only way to speak after this match because I think if I said what I thought about the refereeing I would be suspended for a lot of matches. What I like most at this moment is sitting on the Real Madrid bench. So, to avoid a suspension, I don't say what I think and use a little sarcasm. Real Madrid faced Ramos, 37, who returned to his boyhood club in September and produced a heroic defensive display in a raucous Ramon Sanchez Pizjuan Stadium. Ramos made a stunning save when Alaba tried to head home from close range and then collided with his successor at Madrid, Antonio Rudiger, pressing the Germans' cheeks. Vinicius Jr.'s shot was saved by Sevilla goalkeeper Orjan Nyland before the end of the first half, one of Real Madrid's clearest chances. The goalkeeper then denied Rodrigo's shot early in the second half with a brilliant save with his feet, as the visitors looked for the breakthrough. Ramos, who also elbowed Bellingham in the head and was shown a yellow card for a foul on the England international in the second half. But the deadlock was broken when Alaba, under pressure from Yusef Enesairai, accidentally turned Ocampo's cross into his own net 15 minutes before the end of the match. But the Andalusian team was unable to hold out for long, as Carvajal scored with a header from a free kick executed by Tony Cruz into the net four minutes later. The atmosphere became tense in the final stages when Vinicius pushed Nayland, who fell to the ground theatrically, leading to a shoving match. It was an amazing match, added Ancelotti, whose team will face Sporting Braga in the Champions League on Tuesday before Barcelona next weekend. It was competitive and intense. We played better in the first half than in the second. We started well, but we did not take advantage of the opportunities we had. In the second half we suffered more and Sevilla was more powerful. The result is fair.